Howdy folks, hope you're all having a good one, and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077 Phantom Liberty, where I've spent the last couple of days waiting for Reed to organise some kind of extraction plan for the President. And the plot is very definitely about to thicken. Hey, I'm back in town. What's your status? Sniffed around, did some side gigs. No word, no sign of our runner friend. Then we redouble the effort, all right? Add another pair of eyes. Alex, former team member. She's in Dogtown, under deep cover. She'll help out. Roger that. Got an address? Longshore Stacks, the dive bar called the Moth. After sundown, yeah? Got it. And sense is trained on any potential shadows. How do you like my new ride, by the way? Uh, this is the Militech Hellhound. It's armed with heavy machine guns and guided missile launchers. <laughs> I got this at a substantial discount from El Capitan, from his auto fixer website. There go the guided missiles. Ooh, yes. Uh, it's also extremely heavily armoured. Um, it's basically a tank. <laughs> so you can see the attraction. Uh, yeah, very nice vehicle. Uh, pretty expensive, but as long as you've done a bunch of these uh, vehicle thefts for El Capitan, you earn a substantial discount. So I think the whole thing actually only cost me about 39,000 eddies. So yes, a very, very nice investment. Anyway, off to Dogtown. We have to make contact with yet another undercover spy that Reed used to work with. He goes by the name of Alex. So we're back at the central market at the Longshore Stacks here in Dogtown, and I've, I've seen this bar before, but I haven't noticed anything particularly interesting about it. I guess we'll wait until it's open. Right, so we're looking for an Alex. Aside from the name and the fact that she's a she, I know absolutely nothing about her. See how he likes being alone. Yeah, maybe you're right. Anyway, better get going. Take care. Chin up, sweet kids. Seeing sunshine round the bend. Just don't you let those bastards walk over you. What'll it be, honey buns? Surprise me. Adventurous. How special coming up. Hey V, you at the bar? Sure am. Waiting for you. I'll be there momentarily. There's, uh, one thing you should know. Okay, what did that be? You know that op seven years back that went south? Well, my eyes left me for dead. The cover story was I sold out to Arasaka. I never told Alex it was a cover. So, things could get tense. Mentioning this sooner never entered your mind? Truly, Reed? Damn it. I'm mentioning it now. I'm nearing the entrance. Well, how could this possibly go wrong? And there you are. Enjoy, honey bunch. Thanks. First time in here. I got that right? You new to Dogtown? Oh, hell no. I'm looking for an Alex. Like fuck you are. So, she not You're here? You're on the awfully short list of folks we just don't serve here. Turn the fuck around and get I'll out. I have a gin and tonic. Make it a double. He's with me. You've got some balls. All right, my people. We gotta close up for the day. 
Well, you know, Reed, I mean, I like you and all, Come but it on. might have been a good idea to mention before we got here that the person that we're here to recruit, you know, the person whose loyalty we're going to be counting on, thinks that you're an Arasaka traitor. I'm just saying. Everyone out! Now! Alex. Seven! Seven fucking years in this shithole! Cause of you, Solomon Reed! Holy... Sol ain't getting it. Maybe you will. V, the coin. Myers sent us. Got a mission in Dogtown. With him? FYI, seven years ago, this scumbag stabbed everybody in the back. No, seven years ago, I was ordered to go to ground. And you were fed a cover story. I had to take the fall. There was no other way. Expect me to believe you? Just like that? Get the fuck out of my sight, both of you. Hey, I get it. You and Reed got some mutual splaining to do, clearly. Have at it, then live out the rest of your days in this musty armpit. That's some kind of convoluted threat? No, we actually need you. But maybe you need us more. If you stop and think about Reed's story, it makes sense. I mean, if he really was an Arasaka trader, why would the president trust him? You know, it makes sense. Fuck this. Need a smoke. Should be fucking ashamed, Saul. The hell was that? Did did she just shapeshift? Metatropic cloaking. Perks of the FIA Militech connection. You get to call dibs on their latest gen, cutting edge tech. Could get tense, he said. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let me try this. Give me a minute. You're gonna talk to her. Someone's gotta. And better me than you. <sighs> Couldn't wait till I was done. I'm V, by the way. <sighs> Alex. <laughs> so NUSA's tossing us back into the fray, huh? New mission? Yeah, afraid so. Well, fire away. Serenade me. FIA agent went missing. Reed and I are tasked with finding her. And all of a sudden, FIA remembers I exist. You know Dogtown better than any other operative in their ranks. Their ranks? So you're not FIA. Curious. <sighs> what leverage they had on you. Deal's just for this one op, then I'm out. <laughs> Wouldn't count on brevity. Me? One in the same mission for the last seven fucking years. Been working the local arms and tech dealers since the war. My one op, that. Going real swell. Well, I got less time than that. Always starts the same way. Do them a favor, they promise one in return. Sometimes even deliver. Then one day... They nail your dick to the wall. This op mean that much to you? Cause you're clearly hoping to get something out of it. Question is what? Survival. Woman we're after is offering something that could help me. Just gotta find her first. And by coincidence, Myers also wants her. Who the hell is this bimbo? Songbird. Here it comes. <laughs> Fuck me. Yep. 
Gonna take more than one sig to process that. Yeah, this just keeps getting better and better. She on that short list of peeps you don't serve here too? Never told you the whole story, did he? What story? Story of a clusterfuck op. One that led to Reed disappearing and me being holed up here for seven years. Here's the list of operatives. Reed, Songbird, and me. Haven't heard this, have you? I suspect there's a lot Reed hasn't told me. He's a spy, after all. <laughs> That's just perfect. Tell me you believe in coincidences? Or, fuck it, fate? Cause plug the same variables into an equation, and surprise, gonna get the same fucking result. Shit in, shit out. <sighs> well, you and that hangdog Judas are in luck. Cause I got a nasty habit of repeating the same gonk mistakes. Got conditions, though. So what's your ask? Monaco. Wanna burn rubber along the Riviera? Drink champagne on a yacht with a fucking duchess. Wanna spy's retirement? Diplomatic posting in a warm, gobsmackingly gorgeous place where fruit off the trees is sweet and demand for field work is zero. Think you can manage that? Op orders came from the NUS Prez, so, yeah. Preem. Go back inside, tell him I'm in. Gonna need more oh. nicotine before I look at his face again. Thanks, Alex. Well, that wasn't easy, but it was easier than I expected. So? Didn't tell me the whole story, Reed. That's twice now. But it's taken care of. She'll do it. In exchange for? Once a spy's retirement. Someplace nice. But if you ask me, she's itching to get closure after what went down between you two. So, heard you need someone to hold your hand, Reed. Take you on a tour of NC's asswart. I came to you because I trust you, Alex. If you say so. Fine. Songbird. Heard we got a sniffer out. Song's MIA. Probably here in Dogtown. We were linked. Comms like. Song ventured into cyberspace, then got attacked. She vanished just after. That's all we know. We need a net runner. Kind of spends all their waking hours parsing teraflops of data. Might have caught something. You have someone in mind? Wilkie Slider Laguerre. I should have figured. Went rogue a while back. But I know where that little rat nests. Name like that sounds like one of the voodoo boys. Slider. Care to fill me in? Renegade voodoo boy, murderer turned CI, all around piece of shit. Outside the net, he's blinder than three mice. Damaged occipital lobe. Not even a Kuroshi could mend it. A voodoo boy. Great. So, we paying him a visit? Slider hides out in a would-be spa in Luxor Heights. Flick you exact chords in two sex. Or rendezvous there. Alex and I have some, uh, catching up to do. <laughs> right. Just, uh, don't gouge each other's eyes out. Need both of you alive and healthy. Alright, well, I mean, I suppose that went better than expected. We got Alex on board. Oh, welcome back, Johnny. I will see that tree there. I gotta remember their names. Too many names. Yeah. Something special about it. Fitting, isn't it? How the prettiest thing here in Dogshit Town is a monument to the dead. You're gone, I heard. Still don't get this gonk affinity for symbols and gestures. 
A moment of silence for Stan and the rest? <sighs> no. I got a better idea. Come on. Wouldn't live one for you if I wasn't fresh out just now. Go out on the street. Shit, maybe I am as sentimental as everyone else. When I see those two, Reed, Alex, went through something similar myself. Let them know we're still here! Johnny Silverhand, empathizing with total randos. See it clear as day. Any shred of friendship they've got left will fizzle out. Not right now, but soon. Could have spilled the truth years ago, stayed tuned. But no, stubborn old Reed had his orders. They're soldiers. Stick together through thick and thin, unlike you. Had a choice. Run, or end up like my army chooms, face down in the mud. Think, how many times you willing to get burned before you stop trusting someone? Hmm. I have a point, Johnny. Replace someone with country, or corp. How many times you gotta take a bullet for these motherfuckers in the name of empty promises? Chew on that when you look at those two. Well, aren't you just a cheerful fucker today? Although, I've never realised that that tree was actually a memorial. So, I mean, you know, at least he pointed that out. I mean, it seems fairly obvious when you look at it, but I never really paid much closer attention. Anyway, we've got Alex on board. And since we're looking for a net runner, we're going to need a net runner. But why did it have to be the Voodoo Boys? I mean, I get it. We're looking for a net runner. You need a net runner, and the Voodoo Boys are the best in the business. But they give me the creeps. Also, I don't have a particularly good reputation with them after I wiped most of them out <laughs> earlier on in the plot. Oh god, yeah, here we go. Oh, this is going to be fun. As long as I don't have to win them over with my sparkling personality, we might actually stand a chance. Might be a good idea to let Reed do all the talking and hope they don't realise who I am. You haven't been waiting long, I hope. Well, guess you and Alex needed a while to catch up. Hmm, yeah. All swell now, though. Let's go. Time's at a premium. They posted lookouts. Go figure. I doubt they'll play nice and just let us in. Gotta be another way in. Let's look around. I spotted the shaft on our way in. We just need to find a vent, crawl through to the other side, and open the door. I'll hang back on lookout. Cover you if need be. I don't suppose I could... No, no, I can't just hack the door. That would be too easy. Yeah, same with that one. Oh, hang See on. A door. Ventilation system might be behind it. It's worth a try. Can't hack the terminal. Can't hack the door. Don't know the code. I do have 20 technical skill. Maybe I can... Nope. It's a mechanical door. It just responds to brute force. All right, not getting in that way. The search area up there on the minimap is pretty big, which is... Oh, it just narrowed. Oh, no, it didn't narrow. The map just zoomed out. <laughs> so it's still the same huge search area, which isn't great news, because it means this way in could be anywhere. So let's try scaling the scaffolding and see if I can spot something. Oh, something there. Crafting components. Anyway, cut a long story short, found a way in. I mean, there's always multiple ways of doing these things, but this was the only option available to me. At the hatch. Scale the scaffolding to find it. Right, we're in. Let's see what we can see. Way inside, completely unsecured. Something ain't right. 
Yeah, this this does kind of feel a bit too easy. Okay, that looks like the lobby. I should be able to take advantage of the camera network though. So just back off around the corner while I upload the quick hack. So who's this? Looks like the two guarding the lobby. If you press Z you can get some more detailed information on the target. This is a Voodoo Boy Malfini. Uh, special abilities. Not net running. So, let's get a ping going first, just to identify everybody else on the network. What's that? Ah, nothing important. Oh, that's me up there. Well, you can't see me, I backed off around the corner of the vent. So, there's two of them here. Both Voodoo Boy Malfinis. The important thing is they're not net runners. Let's check the other cameras and we'll come back. So, there's nothing here. Apart from the door, which I can't hack. And, oh, there's plenty of them here. So, who's this? Snake Charmer. Combat stims, EMP grenades. Again, not a net runner. How many more do we have? There's another one. Malfini again. It's quite surprising that none of them appear to be net runners, given that, you know, voodoo boys what they're famous for. But I guess these are just the muscle protecting the Netrunner. The thing is, if I do this properly, I shouldn't ever alert the Netrunner and get counter-traced. So, we're going to go with Sonic Shop to jam and scramble their comms, and then overheat. Now this is a non-lethal takedown. See them still rolling around there, but they're out for the count. There's another one over there. So, I need... 5 RAM for the Sonic Shock, but then I need 9 RAM for the Overheat. So I just need to wait, and there we go, there's the Overheat. We covered enough RAM to get that off while the Sonic Shock was still active. Let's see what's on the other cameras. So this is the same room, just camera on the other side. You can see that one going down there, and I took them out. There's another one. I mean, we could just bust in all guns blazing, and that would probably be slightly more exciting to watch. But this is way safer. I mean, let's not forget, we're dealing with... The guy that we're here to find is a Voodoo Boy Netrunner. I really don't want to get traced and counter-hacked by this guy. So I'm going to do it the safe way. Sonic Shock and Overheat. It is going to take some time, because I'm, I'm limited by how quickly my RAM can regenerate after I upload these quick hacks. But it is by far the safest and quietest way of getting this done. At least until I cycle through the cameras and I actually found the Netrunner. Get the fuck away from me. And as quickly as that, he not only throws me out of the network, <laughs> but he also disables the camera that was observing him. It's now permanently offline. So, uh, yeah. That was Slide All the Gear, the guy we're here for. I think. I'll just have to wait for my RAM to recover again, but I think these are the last two. I'm pretty sure I've dealt with everybody else other than the two guard and the main door. Just need to get some RAM back. I think I need 14 in total. That'll be enough. Five for the Sonic Shock. Come out. Come out. Looks like you had it right. Where the hell did you come from? How did you just walk through that? <laughs> well, what's this? Ah, disarmed. That was close. There were some traps in here. Yeah, it doesn't look like they left these shafts completely unguarded. It was all looking just a little bit suspicious. Right, this I can open. Easy now. No call on attention. Yep, yeah, thanks for that spot of advice there, Reed. Couldn't have done this without you. Right, I think I got all of them, aside from, you know, Slider Laguerre himself. There are still a couple of cameras up, of course, because I was using those to quick hack everybody. And if the cameras spot me, Slider can hack me through the cameras just as easily as I was hacking all of his guards. Let's just make sure I do have all of them. I'm pretty sure I didn't leave anybody else up. Unless, of course, there are more of them 
in positions that aren't covered by the cameras, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I got everybody. I think he knows we're coming, Reed. Best watch your ass. Your spooky shit don't impress anyone, Slider. <laughs> Fuck me. Solomon Reed. I would be lying if I said I have missed you. And you? You brought death to Mama Bridget. <laughs> Will that be your gift for me as well? Ah, oh, so he does know about that. Dunno. Don't know you yet, Slider. I am called many things. Wilkie Laguerre, the blind fury of the cyberspace, a thorn in the NUSA's fat ass. Take your pee. Yeah, you forgot to add double murderer and all around coward. We're here to negotiate, Slider. Cut a deal. If one party is backed into a corner, it is not negotiation, it is extortion. You say tomato, I say fucking deal with it, Slider. Now, cut the shit, and do us the courtesy of hearing us out. Need some intel. Street says you're the one to get it. Me? <laughs> I am a blind man. I see nothing, know nothing. Cyberspace is my only field of vision. Well, just so happens what we need is one who knows cyberspace. Sees lots in it. Donk, dim, sir. What specifically do you want from me? Soon after SF-1 crashed, a runner was attacked while on the net. Attack severed our link. Need to locate her stat. Ah, so you want one to investigate net traffic on the day of the crash? Got a malfunctioning relic in my skull. That's how she made contact. That help any? Hmm. Perhaps I will need a peek at this trinket in your head. Fuck no. No, nah, no chance, Slider. Not letting this creepy fuck into my head. It is this or nothing. You choose. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, fine. Keep your eyes on him, Reed. I am blind, not deaf. Let us see what we have here. I see traces, bursts of data in cyberspace, the wake of someone's passage. Who dare they mad? This I do not believe. You out of your mind coming to me with this shit. What you see? The black wall. It bring only death. Specific, Slider. The woman. Did you know she used the black wall protocol to connect with you? Fuck. Explains a lot, actually. The woman? She is walking, ticking bomb, megatons. She go boom. Everybody fucked in the ass. Every last one. Miwa Noir. It is a dam that protects us, the civilized world, from the strange pets of the cyber wilderness. If your two-leg bomb crack the dam down the middle, it will unleash a flood. Wipe us off the map, just like Haiti. He's not wrong. Rogue AIs will drown the net, and all of us with it. To the AIs, past the black wall, you are no more than a cockroach, a rabbit, a fragment of outdated code with no meaning. 
This why Netwatch flatline any who put integrity of Blackwall at risk. It's no laughing matter, my friend. It is a concern for the safety of all. That's why you, my friend, need to restore V's connection to our girl. You are out of your mind. Heard what he said about messing with the Blackwall, right? Risky business. It's even riskier to let Soundberg poke more holes in it. We need to make contact with her. Communication's key. Perhaps you do. I do not. Non-negotiable, Slider. We need to find her. Besides, as long as she's out there, they catch her scent, they catch yours now, too. They'll sit their wirehead freaks on to you and your people. So, you'll help me clean this up, cover all tracks, snip any threads leading back to you and consequently us. He does make a compelling argument. Do that, and we'll be square. You'll be off the FIA's hook, too. <sighs> Meld. It's my lucky day. I didn't. You didn't need to know that. Risky shit, that. I'm putting my life on the line, not yours. Blackwall the Relic was the only way to reach you after SF1 was hacked. Listen, babe. Don't have much time. Hanson's people tracked me down after I res the Chimera. I've been... detained. I'm not in any danger. Not as long as I behave. Do what I'm told. I need your help. Yes. Slider, what's going on? Something's not right, man. Ah! Fucking black wall. <sighs> black Sapphire V. Hanson's hosting a huge shindig there. Crash it on the sly. I'll find you. Make sure to tell Ray. I have a sapphire. Fuck. Jack him out, Reed! Unplug Slider! Now! It's over. You short sucked. Slider. He flatlined because of us. Flatline, period. Need you to come clean. Were you gonna off him no matter what? Questions moot. Slide is dead. What's done is done. So that's a yes then. So, Songbird. What's up with her? Got the link back up. We spoke. She's fine, mostly. Needs our help, but she's fine. In one piece. Alright. Give me the deets later. Time to doubt a V. Just because we got in without dropping bodies doesn't mean they'll wave us goodbye. Bon voyage, Slider. What's Reed so concerned about? I took care of everybody on the way in. Let's have a quick look around, make sure there's nothing here that I can... But what are you panicking about, Reed? <laughs> Did you not see me? Oh, I don't know. Oh, right. Yeah. Okay, there is trouble. <laughs> Fine. Okay. Uh, well, I guess I've burnt all of my bridges here, so 
there's no longer any real point in you know trying to do this the gentle way so uh, let's exercise the nuclear option it's been a while since I oh I have a new smart gun by the way this is a smart assault rifle it's iconic which means it can be upgraded to tier 5 at the moment I think it's tier 5 plus it's really really nice you can get this by doing a side mission with the 6th Street Gang down in Rancho Coronado on Capitan's territory. Uh, they're running a shooting competition and if you win it, this is the reward. But come on, Reed. You're supposed to be a professional. Stop running in front of my muzzle. I mean, I know it's a smart gun, but it's not that smart. I'm empty. Need reload. This thing does stupid amounts of damage, by the way. And it has, because it's a it's an iconic weapon. It has a special ability. Actually, it has two. Uh, one of its special abilities is it has a random chance every time you fire that it's going to actually create a poison burst on the target. Oh, uh, don't worry about that. Electrical shot going off. That's a defensive ability. Um, but the other thing that it can do is there's a 5% chance that every time a bullet hits a target, it's going to trigger a random quick tank on it. It is a very, very good weapon. Plus the other great thing about smart guns is as long as you've got a target lock on somebody, it doesn't matter if they duck behind cover, you can just fire around it. That's all of them. Hey, level 40. Right. That seems to be it. Yeah, we've cleared everybody out. Let's just make sure I pick up any loot. There's some epic gear lying around. Wow, these guys have all got skill shards on them. I am happy with that. All right, Reed, we're done. I think I've looted basically everything that needs looting. So let's have a chat, you and me. I fucking knew this was all tied to rogue AIs from beyond the Black Wall. Although I'm no longer convinced that Songbird is actually hosting one of them. But it's still not good. I mean, there's a reason why Netwatch just flatlines anybody who fucks with the integrity of the Black Wall. You know, no court, no trial, nothing. They just kill you dead. And Netwatch is one of the few agencies that operates basically independently of governments. Nobody wants a breach in the Black Wall. What did Songbird tell you? She's tapped into the Black Wall. Didn't deny it. No big thing. Kinda. We need to find her, fast. Did she drop any coordinates? Song needs our help, Reed. Hansen's nabbed her, holding her, for reasons. God damn it. I can't imagine any worse news than that. Black Sapphire. Said Hansen's throwing a big bash there. We get in, she'll find us. Any idea what and where the Sapphire is? Over there. See the tall of the two scrapers? Next to the one with the big ass screen. That's the Black Sapphire. A would-be hotel ended up a failed multi-billion eddy investment. Hence, as fortress, smack in the middle of Dogtown. We can't just barge in. Doubt we have anyone on the inside or affiliated who could crack open a door either. Alex and I will pull some strings, run our contacts. We do the same. You know, think of who you know around here. Maybe what will happen on an idea, find a way. Your local fixer goes by Mr. Hands. Could ring him. Do it. We'll be in touch. So, I'm not going to say any of this was good news, <laughs> because it wasn't, but at least we're making progress. See you in the next episode, when I suppose we'll find out just exactly how much worse things can get. In the meantime, I hope you've enjoyed this one. Hope you're all having a great weekend, and as always, take care, and I'll catch you next time.